Hi guys, good morning! Today I'm going to go to Kuramae, which is called the Brooklyn of Tokyo. I actually purchased this. It's all in Japanese though, but I think if you really want to challenge your reading, then please consider picking this up. It was 900 yen, so not bad at all. And I love that it divides Tokyo into different parts, like around the stations. I'm actually running a little bit late, Cindy just texted me. It's gonna be another really fun day. We're probably going to walk around again, take pictures, and cafe hop. So if you guys are into that, please continue watching. My outfit today, bag from Zozo Town, jacket from Tagaytay that I thrifted for 50 pesos, top from Grail and bottoms from Shein and shoes from Zozo Town. Lunch menu. What do you think you'll get? This looks so good. Steak lunch. Sutaki. Fine lunch plan. This is the weekly lunch menu. What are you gonna get? Oh, they have like I mean, monthly party menu. Yeah. <laughs> oh, stewed hamburg lunch looks good. If you want to get a better seat by the window, you have to reserve in advance. So I got today's menu and Cindy got the monthly pasta. <laughs> And then you ended up liking it. Yeah. <laughs> now we're gonna walk around this area. Cindy and I have both never been here, but um, it came as a recommendation from a student of mine who called Kuramae the Brooklyn of Tokyo. So yeah, we're just gonna see what happens. So probably cafe hop. But first we're gonna walk around the river and we're gonna try to get some pictures with Tokyo Sky Tree in the background. FYI, I think Tokyo Sky Tree is taller than Tokyo Tower. Yes. Right? <laughs> so yeah, just a fun little piece of trivia for you. He just wanted me to show you. <laughs> yeah. Um it's a good thing that the, it's a K, not B for Toy Bridge. I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah. Grade four. Grade four silver. <laughs> yeah, I'm not yet. The Sakura hasn't bloomed yet, but this has been a nice vantage point. Oh, it's closed. No entry. <laughs> no entry. Wait now. Nice. We can actually walk down this area, shall we? Now I want to take Cindy <laughs> to this um, tourist information office. I don't know if it'll, if it'll be open, but from the 5th or 6th floor, you can actually see a really nice bird's eye view of Asakusa, which is a major tourist attraction here in Tokyo. There she is! It's actually on the 8th floor. It's a free observatory that you can look out and see Asakusa. Actually, before you could even go down here, but I guess they closed it for some reason. But there, you can see Asakusa and the shopping street. I highly suggest you come here, and for some reason today, there's nobody here. So take advantage of it if you can. For some reason, we came across the Bandai, what looks like the headquarters. Ampan Man, he's a bread character. Bread character. <laughs> I don't know who this is. 
<laughs> Goku, Doraemon, who else? Who's this? I'm s Ultraman? Oh, do not climb or vandalize the character. <laughs> oh my gosh, Cindy! So cute! What? This is so random! Cute. You want to take a picture with her? Okay, sige. Hold on. Tiny little shrines in this area. Wow. Cindy said pick a color. Blue bronze. Look at that honeycomb building. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, look at the building behind it. Amazing. <laughs> A few OPM songs later, and here we are in front of Dandelion, a cafe that specializes in chocolate. Na himawari is sunflower though. Dandelion. <laughs> Now we're at the Dandelion Chocolate Cafe here in Kuramai and we got here just as the seats were just filling up. Um, it is a little noisy on the first floor because I think it's like their factory or bakery where they make all the chocolate and yeah, as you expect, everything on the menu is different kinds of hot chocolate. Um, Cindy got the frozen hot chocolate, I got the Kuramai hot chocolate. Yeah, so now we're walking back to Kuramae Station, the Oedo Line exit. Maybe we're going to take pictures, we're not sure yet. But we have one last cafe that we want to visit. Did you like the Dandelion Cafe? How was yes, it? Yes, it was so nice. <laughs> Her cookie was... My cookie was 80% chocolate and 20% flour. <laughs> Earlier, I said that my student told me that this is Tokyo's Brooklyn. However, I feel like it could be Tokyo's Escolta. Escolta is a place in Manila that has a lot of old buildings, but some of them are actually renovated inside. And those are the kinds of buildings that we've been going through this whole time. <laughs> Cindy and I have been looking around at the apartments for no reason. It's because it's just interesting to see where the different people live in Tokyo. So the weather cleared up a little bit. And that's the cafe that we were at a while ago. A lot of people like to go jogging. We almost got run over a few times a while ago taking pictures. Suddenly, an explosion of plum blossoms. What? <laughs> wow, that's beautiful. Okay. <laughs> I wish the camera could capture how massive it actually is. done visiting Cafe Nova. It was really, it was very cozy I think and the fact that the owner was so accommodating made it even I think 
made it even nicer for us to stay in. However, they do have a time limit of one hour. So if you want to stay in a cafe and chill, that's probably not the cafe for it. But um, the coffee is really good. I would recommend going here. Overall, I think like Kuramai is an area that isn't so similar to Brooklyn, but it just has a lot of cafes. <laughs> Um, that are clumped together so i guess it's easy access for anyone who wants to go cafe hopping like us um it's quite near to asakusa so maybe if you have time after you tour that area you can come over here but i don't think it's a must go to place maybe that chocolate place is though but yes. like, <laughs> other than that it's pretty chill so yeah i'll see you guys next time bye, bye.